If you call the island name of Anguilla, it may not be synonymous with any great international superstar, except maybe Banky Banks. He has been struggling in the business for quite some time now. Here he is in one of his video presentations doing screaming. And right after, we'll meet Banky Banks. Screaming 
From Anguilla he comes Banky Banks and Screaming. Well, Banky Banks graced the studios with his magnificent presence, and we had a chat together. And I first asked Banky how would he describe himself? Well, an artist. <laughs> this is an artist. Uh, I use the art. Uh, I use music as, uh, as my... Music and song as my brush, like a painter. <laughs> and I try to, uh, to put across uh, things related to uh, life, the world crisis, social things, and that's the way. You were influenced in a great way by the late Bob Marley. Yes, I was. And um, you performed at the uh, Sun Splash uh -huh. in 1983. Uh -huh. And uh, that must have been a memorable experience for you. Definitely. It was, uh, as a matter of fact, we were the first band from the Eastern Caribbean to take part in Reggae Sun Splash in Jamaica. So that was like an honor for us from a small island to do that. And uh, it was a tremendous experience to be on the same bill with all the, the big dance way back in 1983. You have traveled the world, Eastern Europe, Western Europe, North America. You have played with Jimmy Cliff. You even had a, um, a session with the international star Bob Dylan. Yeah, I did. What does it do to an artist to be around his peers of such outstanding repute? Well, it makes you, it, uh, it, it gives you a good feeling, first of all, because uh, as you say, with your peers, you know, it's. Uh, the music business is a very tough business. It's very hard that you get to. Very, it's not very very easy to get to rub shoulders with the <laughs> with the uh, people who are there. And when you can do that, you can pick up a lot of stuff. You can learn a lot of stuff, a lot of uh, a lot of information, lots of things. Depends on how you use your time with people around. So it's always been for me. It's I feel honored to be able to do that. And uh, and yes. Uh, you from Anguilla, Anguilla in the British West Indies. A lot of people who may be looking right now may never have heard about Anguilla. Uh -huh. And you have done as a, a local boy, if uh -huh. you may, from Island Anguilla. Boy. Island boy. Right. <laughs> from Anguilla. I mean, what you have done, this is an astronomical task. Well, it's hard I mean, work. It's just, I think anyway, you can do whatever you want to do. I always wanted to do what I'm doing and do it a good way, do the right thing and do it do it in the right way, you know, to do, to go all the way. Anything I'm into, I go all the way. I don't want to be halfway down the line as an artist. I mean, the Caribbean, way back when you say you're a musician, people say, hey, what do you do? You know, what's your job? I got into music, I decided to make it my life. The complacent Banky Banks on Culture Share.